गुरु ब्रह्मा गुरु विष्णु गुरु देवो महेश्वरा गुरु साक्षात पर ब्रह्मा तस्मे श्री गुरुवे नम हे भगवान दाय चाइल्ड्स टाइनी हैंड्स हैव गैदर्ड दीज स्मॉल फ्लावर्स फ्रॉम द इमेंस गार्डन ऑफ द ग्लोरी एंड वुमन देम इन टू ए क्लम्स गार्डन बट इट इज ऑफर्ड एट दाइज divine feet with a big noise calling it all about shivananda the fragrance and the beauty and the color belong to thee it is thine own unsurpassable love for the children that makes thee accept this too it was said of lord krishna that everything about him was sweet it is true of bhagwan shivananda today dr kuppa swami transformed himself into swami shivananda and the austere stern and hard task master swami shivananda has somehow mysteriously vanished when and how no one knows the shiva we see in our midst today is the most lovable concrete manifestation of divine life may that love dwell in our heart सतगुरु भगवान की जय शिवानंदाज मेथड ऑफ मेडिटेशन बाय स्वामी वेंकटेशनंद Shiva is the living illustration of Brahma Karma Samadhi which Lord Krishna has described in the Bhagavad Gita. He is a lifelong ceaseless meditation on the absolute. It is Shiva who has fulfilled the mission of the sages of the Upanishads and who has synthesized meditation and life itself into a divine unbroken experience of God consciousness. His life demonstrates his teachings and he instructs his disciples to practice what he has aptly termed battlefield pratyahara. The aspirant should be able to shut in the mind on the battlefield of daily life anywhere at any time. At the same time, Shiva insists upon the first attempt at meditation in the quiet early morning hours Brahma Muhurta. This is when the sadaka fixes his mind on God, Dharana. The rest of the day is to be meditation, unbroken God consciousness in the midst of endless routine of variegated activity. Shiva is synthesis every inch of him he cannot see difference among the yogas religions or systems of philosophic thought to prove this this be god has gathered the essence from all yogas and from all religions and in his own honeycomb the sivananda literature given us the honey of divine life the yoga of synthesis he wants us to be bhaktas and yogins dhyanins and jnanins dynamic selfless workers and detached vedantins all at the same time he leads the way the continuous meditation during the day that shiva practices and preaches is thus made to run through all the grooves of the yoga of synthesis god in the man makes us his servants god in the shrines makes us his devotees god within us beckons to us to close our eyes and remain self forgetfully absorbed in him God in all reveals the cosmic consciousness that pervades all creation and transcends it. This is the method of meditation that Lord Sivananda exemplifies in himself for our emulation. Bhagavate Shiva